What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general uh, collective reading. Cups to side you, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general collective reading. So it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess to Rope by. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash out. No Venmo. Uh, it's a very private, confidential way to donate. I do not publicly display your name or how much you donate for privacy and confidentiality purposes. Okay, so um, the channel message I received was a um, religious organization is in the middle of a lawsuit right now with um, a group. I heard a group um, gag order in place. I heard gag order in place. However, through many series of chain of events, someone has found out that this lawsuit has taken um, is taking place, not part of the gag order. They are about to very publicly spread it around the community. It's about to um, ruin this um, this religious organization's plans. It's going to create um, many negative series of chain of events. I heard huge negative power moments coming for. Um, for this situation so you plug it in how it resonates that is holy crap a bully um so you plug it in how it resonates saw saw legal paperwork in a home okay i just heard saw legal paperwork in a home oh my god so oh lord so you plug it in how it resonates okay so we've got a religious organization in the middle of a lawsuit i heard with a group with a group of people now, whoever in the world they're in the, a lawsuit with, you have to plug this religious organization in. If you if you are part of this religious organization or part of the lawsuit or you know somebody that is, um, but the gag order is supposed to prevent, um, you know, we've been pulling a lot of gag order energy in here. I had to look it up on Google because I wasn't sure what a gag, a, gag, a gag order was. But it's basically an order from a judge not to talk about the case period, um, to all parties. Um, that's what a gag order technically is via, via Google definitions. But I heard whoever this person is that's about to spread it all around the community, they have saw some kind of legal paperwork in somebody's home. They have, so it sounds like recent past, they have saw it in somebody's home and I heard they're about to spread it all around the community. So they're a huge gossiper. Um, Lucy Lips over there or, or um, Lucy Lips, masculine or feminine, Lucy Lips, um, gossip, Gail, gossip, Gary, energy. Whoever this person is, I heard they're about to spread all around the town, the city, the what have you. Um, community, I heard community, so it could be a small town, a city, whatever, whatever community this is, whatever uh, religious organization this is, period. But they were smart enough to get a gag order, but I heard the person that's about to spread it all around is not part of the gag order, but they saw this legal paperwork, I guess, from this religious organization, a person in the middle of this lawsuit, I guess, in the religious organization. Um, they saw it. It sounds like in their home or somebody's home in a part of this. Um, I heard it's going to create many negative tower moments and uh, many shocking series of chain of events negatively, I guess, for this lawsuit energy, this religious organization or what have you. Um, holy crap, this sounds cray cray, but you plug it in, how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. I might pull some cards. I might not. I wasn't expecting to get this one. I was on here reading the poem earlier and then I was sitting here chilling and I got, I got the channel. So, um, let me see if I hear anything else. It's about to create chaos in this community chaos somebody's going to end up calling the news station know this oh my god whoa i heard it's going to create it's about to create chaos in this community chaos somebody is uh, in this situation is going to end up calling the news station so whoever who and i didn't hear a sign of who saw the legal paperwork i i haven't heard signs of anybody 
um, is just somebody has already in the recent past saw this legal paperwork in somebody's home um, in the middle of this lawsuit. Buy the book. We have buy the book. This is about to become a huge thing. Huge, 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 huge gossip here. It's going to be blown way out of the a proportion the way these people didn't want it to go down. It's going to go completely the other way. Oh my God, so you plug it in how it resonates. So they wanted to go by the book is what I'm presuming here. They wanted to go by the book with the gag order um, being put in place. It sounds like the people are part of this gag order is following it, um, is what it sounds like here. So the people that are part of this gag order are following it. They're going by the book the way you're supposed to. But some, whoever in the world that was in somebody's home, it sounds like in the recent past that saw this legal paperwork, um, is not part of the gag order, and I guess they didn't know about the gag order, or they know they're not a part of the gag order. How that resonates, and um, they're about to be gossip Gale, gossip Gary, and it's about to just basically blow it, blow the cover, blow it all to hell. Um, I heard it's about to get so bad in the community, somebody's about to call the news station, and it's going to blow up into a huge thing. So they wanted to go by the book. But it's not, it doesn't sound like it's about to. I, I heard from Spirit that it's about to go completely the other way. Um, holy crap and moly. Number 11 might be very significant in somebody's life. Number 11, that could be a possible age of a child or your child or somebody you're connected to's child, a date of birth number, a social security card number, a green card number, a lottery number, a jersey number, number 11. Also, I just heard 1111, 1111, um, and that's a very significant number in this situation, I'm assuming, in this reading. Um, let me um, Google 1111. I know I know what it means, but we're, do, we're doing it because this is serious right here. Woo. Okay. The angel number 1111 meaning is a reminder that we are, we are all one, all interconnected. It's also a call to action asking you to align your thoughts and actions with your highest good and best self. You are manifesting your thoughts, so keep them positive. Someone really, really needs to hear this. Okay, I just heard someone really, really needs to hear this. So, um, angel number 11, I'll read one more time. Angel number 1111, meaning is a reminder that we are all one, all interconnected. It's also a call to action, asking you to align your thoughts and actions with your highest good and best self. It's about to blow these people's cover in a huge way. Oh my God, whoa, I heard it's about to blow these people's cover in a huge way. And it's going to cause more lawsuits. Okay, I heard it's going to cause more lawsuits. It's about to blow these people's cover in a huge way and it's going to cause more lawsuits. Lawsuits, so they wanted to go one way, by the book, the legal way, um, um, but um, some gossip gale or gossip Gary that it was, uh, sounds like recently been in somebody's home has seen this legal paperwork and they're about to blow it all to hell in the community. Now, whether they knew about the gag order or not, I don't know. Cause I'm not the one that has recently been in somebody's home perusing somebody's legal paperwork. Um, that's not my business and I don't go in people's homes, um, unless I have to, if I'm in a workplace situation. So, um, Whoever this person is that's recently been in somebody's home that's basically about to chatter it all over the community. Um, but, oh my goodness. I heard it's about, they wanted to go one way, but it is about to go a completely different way. So much so, heard somebody's about to call the news station. It's about to basically blow all the hell. Um, and um, I heard angel number 1111 in here, and that's basically we're all interconnected. So I think that's the gossip train energy here um, and the news station energy. Um, this is about to become a very, very, very serious situation. Very, very quickly. 
Oh my God, I heard this is about to become a very, very, very serious situation very quickly. So you plug it in how it resonates. So it's about to become a very, very, very serious situation very quickly. Um, this religious organization lawsuit that, that they wanted to keep so private and so confidential. Um, oh my goodness. I don't even know what to say about this. I, I just don't even know what to say about this. Um, let me pull one card. Um, spirit messages you have reflected. And I was going to tell you guys too that I really want to do sign readings for you guys. I really, really do um, while I'm shuffling out. I really want to do sign readings. I truly, truly do. I want to I want to do it so bad because it's just me here and I'm bored as crap. Um, and I meditated about it and I, I really, really meditated and I did get a spiritual download from Spiritual Realm and I basically... Um, I was told by spiritual realm I could, I just couldn't use spirit messages. Um, so I had contemplated doing this. Maybe tomorrow I might do some sign readings, but I, I cannot use this, the spiritual messages. And that's going to be hard because y'all know when I get on here, I'm really, I, I've been, a cha I've been a channeler of over a year and a half now. I know how to, I mean, I, it's second nature to me. Um, so it's going to be really hard. It's going to be really hard not to do that. So I'll have to probably get on here off the camera and do it a few times and hone, not hone in on the energy of channeling, I guess, before I put it on the camera, just to let everybody know. Um, because, uh, that's going to be hard because I'm so used to channeling now. So, um, so we'll see tomorrow how it goes. Um, if I get on the camera, just know i practice it for a while before I got on here uh, because I'm so used to channeling in now, you know? Okay. So I shuffled, I got loyal heart reverse number 35 might be very significant number in somebody's life. Number 35, a possible age of viewers somebody you're connected to possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible, um, uh, green card number, um, possible, um, Jersey number, et cetera, et cetera. Number 35. This person that was allowed in the home that saw the legal paperwork, the other person is going to feel very, very betrayed. It's about to turn into a huge thing very quickly. Oh my gosh. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So this person that has recently been in somebody's home and saw this legal paperwork, um, and apparently it's gossiping. They either are gossiping it all across the community now, or they're about to, however that resonates. Um, however this plugs into whoever's life, but I heard the person's home they have recently been in that saw the legal paperwork that is basically either gossiping out in the community now about this or is about to be, uh, I heard they're going to feel very betrayed, um, or they do now, or they're about to feel very betrayed. Um, you should have known this was going to happen. You do not choose your friends very wisely. Oh, whoa, snap. So you plug it in, how I say, whoever that's for, um, this is for at least one person I feel that watches me. I'll tell you that because why am I pulling this in? Um, I, this is for somebody. Well, either you watch me or this is for somebody in the universe. How this resonates. Um, but I've noticed the channels, channelings I pull in, they have been heavily, heavily, heavily resonating with people, my subscribers. I mean, I'm get, I get, I get many, many, many messages every day. Thank you so much. They resonate. Thank you so much. They resonate. Oh my God, this resonated. Oh my God, this resonated. So I mean, I know they're resonating, I, and they're resonating heavily. So I feel whoever you are, you watch my videos. Is what I'm saying. So I heard you uh, should have known this was going to happen. You don't pick your friends very wisely. So whoever this person is that's recently been in your home, you consider them a friend, but apparently they are a friend of me, meaning they, they're, they're not loyal. They backstab, they betray, they talk behind your back. They say you're your friend to your face and they're really not. Whoever you are, only you know your story, not anybody else. But I feel you watch my channel and maybe the betrayer watches my channel too. I'm not sure. You have to plug your story in however it resonates. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But it's, it sounds like somebody's about to know about the lawsuit. I'll tell you that. All over the freaking community via your friend of me. Oh, my God. Woo!
Okay, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't. Okay, but I heard it's going to turn into more lawsuits. So it it's about to turn into more lawsuits. Um, this is some strong, strong energy. Whoever this is for, but at least the person, I feel the person that you allowed this friend or friend of me in your home recently that has, um, saw this legal paperwork and they're about to either, they're already spreading it now or they're about to be spreading it out in the community and it's about to cause more lawsuits. Um, I feel you watch my channel because um, I heard the person specifically that allowed the person in the home. So whoever you are, whoever you are, whoever you, only you know who you are. All right. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.